Hello, it's Jeanette J Beauty and welcome to my channel. I just finished washing my hair with the all vegan and cruelty free products and my hair feels really good. It's soft, it's moisturized and manageable. I wanted to make sure that my hair and scalp is very clean but not stripped and my hair definitely feels like it has a lot of moisture and it's really manageable. This is very important to me when doing any style, especially coming from wash day, it's going to really prep my styles up for success. Right now, I'm just sectioning my hair into quadrants. This is what I always do, no matter if I'm washing my hair or if I'm styling it, because I can apply my products in my hair a lot better this way and just make sure that all of my hair is the TLC that it needs and deserves. After I've sectioned my hair into quadrants, I'm just going to work on one section at a time. I like to work back to front. It just makes the whole process a lot more easier. I'm going to start with this section and mist it with a lot of water. My hair is very receptive to water and I've noticed that applying products afterwards is just really glides into my hair so much easier when my hair is nice and moisturized. So that's why I do use a lot of water and I love this mister bottle. It just makes the whole process of applying my product so much easier now I'm going to apply my leave-in conditioner and this is from Oyen it is their hairdo leave-in conditioner and as you can see it is just sliding in my hair so effortlessly and that's really important I want to make sure that the products are penetrating into my hair strands versus sitting on top of them and that's one way that I know the product is working for me as you can see my curls are starting to come together which is a very good sign for my oil, I'm going to use hemp seed oil, and let me tell you, this oil is amazing. I'm so glad that I found this oil, and I've been using it in my hair because it's not a thick oil. It's in between a lightweight and thick oil, so it has a great consistency, but it still provides me with sealing that moisture in, which is very important. This hemp seed oil is becoming a staple of mine. I just love it, and I will definitely be adding it into my pre poos after I've applied the leave-in conditioner, the oil worked in really good with the white tooth comb just to make sure that all the products are distributed well into my hair. I'm going to twist it. Twisting my hair really allows for that moisture to stay in my hair versus just leaving or my hair can get frizzy at the bottom or undone. I just noticed that when my hair is twisted, it just really locks into that moisture, that condition that these products are providing for my hair and scalp. After I've applied the leave-in conditioner, the oil, and twisted my hair, I'm just going to clip it up and continue this process on the other three sections of my hair. And I absolutely love layering products in my hair because this is when I get the most definition. I've noticed that my hair, it just really thrives. So I will always apply a leave-in conditioner. I will always apply an oil. And for the C, it really varies. So sometimes I'll apply a mousse or a foam, a curling custard, a gel, a cream. And it really depends on the style I'm doing, honestly. Like today, I will be applying a curling custard, which is kind of similar to a gel, but I will always use that format. I love applying the LOC method or just that kind of blueprint to my hair because it really helps to hold that moisture in my hair. I notice that my curls are more defined. My hair, it just really thrives and my styles last a lot longer doing this so I really like applying all these products to wet hair because I'm actually molding it for my style when you apply products and you let it dry fully then when you unravel or say if I'm even doing a wash and go my styles will adhere to the style that I initially did when my hair was wet so I really want to stress the importance of layering products to your hair you really want to set your styles up for success and you really want to make sure that your hair is really nice and moisturized because that's when it will perform the best
After applying the leave-in conditioner and oil to my hair and letting it sit while I work on the other sections of my hair is really beneficial for my hair overall. What I'm actually doing is just letting these products really marinate and penetrate into the hair strands. And I started doing this process a little while ago and I have noticed an overall improvement of the health of my hair and also the integrity. My hair is not only prepped for the style but also that my hair's health as a whole is so much better. And the next step, I'm going to use the High Definition Curl Enhancer Styling Gel from Trey Lux. And actually when I mentioned I bought this in my Instagram story, they reached out to me and suggested how I should apply it for optimal results. And that was by applying a little bit more water. So of course, I did apply more water before I applied about a quarter size amount of this gel. And let me tell you, my curls are popping. This is why moisture is so important for the hair. You wanna make sure that your hair is fully moisturized before you apply these products and I know it may take a little bit longer but the results are so good so it may take a little bit longer for wash day for styling my hair but I don't have to style my hair for another week or so I can stretch it to two weeks if I'm really pushing it but I try not to I want to wash my hair every week but I'm telling you my hair looks so good when I do these steps I really love applying the products and layering products in my hair and as you can see my curls are popping And even on to the next section, these products are working in my hair so good. And here's how the back of my hair looks after I finish applying the products. Here's how my hair looks after applying all the products. I will apply just a little bit more gel if I see there's an area that can use some more and then scrunch my hair going upwards. I did not come to play or waste any time. I wanna make sure that this style comes out good and right. So if I need to apply any more products, I will do so. And it is 5.16 a.m. So I'm about ready to go to bed. I'm tired. And what I'm going to do since I'm going to bed is apply two shower caps to my hair. And ever since I started doing this last year when I did a wash and go, I did it at night so that I could do this step. I am going to apply two shower caps to my hair and what this does is keep the moisture in my hair and it also allows for the products that I use to really marinate and go into the hair follicle so it can perform a lot better. I noticed that doing a night wash and go this way versus doing a wash and go say in the morning and then letting my hair air dry, it's like night and day. My hair turns out a whole lot better when I do it this way and just do a night wash and go put the shower cap on, let the products marinate, and then when the next day when I'm ready to start my day, my hair will be damp, and then I'll just let my hair air dry this way. So here's how my hair looks after about six hours of air drying. My hair is completely dried. It looks really good. Curl definition is on point. My hair looks so good, and I'm really happy with all the products. There is a gel cast in my hair, which is okay because I can always use some oils and water to kind of separate that and break it up but I'm about to go to bed again 
all I did was just lounge around in the house, nothing much. And the next day, I will be going out. So that's when I'm going to really <laughs> jazz my hair up, as you can see. So I'm just going to take the scarf off, miss some water, and then pick my hair out for some added volume. And here's how my hair came out. It looks really good. I love the volume and the definition. To style my hair, I just added a side part. I think it looks a lot better on me. And here is the finished look. I absolutely love it. And the next day, I went out to a little brunch. And here's how my hair looks. It looks really good. I love the volume, the definition overall great results i really hope that you enjoyed my video and i will see you in the next one bye I need one more.